subjects, we are being attacked. We are at war. What happens next, you'll find out on the upcoming show. King Hill, look what I found on these old deserted railroad tracks. Great, SB, but how does it run? I've been wondering about that. I've got it. When you push up like this and, and down like that, it makes the thing move. Here, let me try that. Hey, wait up for your old pal. There. Uh oh, a tree. And right on the tracks. Hey, 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 a tunnel right through that tree. A lucky break. Well, we're safe now. Are we? I'm not so sure. Well, you can start by handing me my binoculars. Thank you. Hmm, a battleship and heading this way. Primates. Glad you could watch our test maneuvers today, Colonel. The area I've chosen for our mock invasion is, of course, completely uninhabited. Uh, inhabited. Not a living soul to shoot back at our man. But good practice nonetheless, eh? Exactly. Subjects, we are being attacked. We are at war. At war? At war? Well, where do we hide? We will not hide. We will defeat this enemy. Billy Blade, you are in charge of Operation Banana Peel. Each banana peel you place in the enemy's path will slow him down and give us time to prepare our defenses. All right, everyone to their post. To what post? How should I know? Just run. This is triple stupid. <laughs> Ready? General in charge of the enemy troops. Aye, aye, sir. Wait a minute. They're flashing a message by Morris code. What does it say? General. That would be me. <laughs> General! 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 <laughs> I don't know who you are, but you have trained the finest fighting machine 
it has ever been my privilege, correction, that's privilege, to fight against. I salute you and each of your crack troops. That would be all of you. Remember us? And that boulder ahead? Well, this is goodbye. A slight bump on the noggin, but wait it. Here we go again, King Yo. We don't slow down, we'll miss that coin. Gotcha. And I got you. Enjoy the next story. Goodwitch, the only human in the forest. Oh, not that I'm lonely or anything, but I was thinking I'd rent out the back room. Having a rumor would give me somebody around I could work my magic on and be generally mean to. <laughs> There, that ought to do it. Room for rent. I'm kind of looking forward to having another human around. I was strolling through the forest one day, and that oh so merry month they call it May. I was taken by surprise by your big fat loving eyes. Well, looky, looky, what have we here? This must be the place. Old sugar bear is moving in the stay. I mean, it's no fun living in a tree or a cave. I'm kind of a house bear at heart. Oh, I'm only a house bear, a house bear at heart. Hi, Granny, old witch. What are you up to, baby? Sugar bear, honey. What a treat to see you. But listen, if you've got ideas about moving in, forget it. I've got my heart set on trapping. I mean inviting a human. And you're no human. Thank you, Granny, but my mind's made up. Be back in a jiff with my duds. Nerds. Looks like I'll have to use my magic on the dear thing. Abracadabra Kliger, I'll chase you out with a tiger. <laughs> Come on, sick him or something. Like a friend, Granny Baby. Now, where's my room? Oh, I'll get rid of you in a really big way. Abracadabra, Smellifant. In a flash, you'll be smashed by this elephant. <laughs> hey, Big Daddy. You ever see such big mouse? Squeak, squeak. Now, if you kindly draw me a bath, set up the guest house, fluff up the pillows, and leave me some stationery. Well, if I can keep you out, I'll keep you in. Abracadabra, Moldu. This thick brick wall ought to hold you. <laughs> the kid is back, darling. I've got a big smile. Quick look at my sweet, my sweet. Then let's eat. <laughs> Hi, 
it's wonderful me again, the only human in the forest. And when I say in the forest, I mean in the forest. Well, good good morning, Rumi. Nice to have you aboard. Just want to remind you about paying your rent promptly. <laughs> Remember I fell off a cliff? This might just work. There. Wow. Now start looking for a break. There. Look. It says B-R-A-K-E break. I will apply it. Oh, talk about getting a hot foot. Hey, there's a sign up ahead there. What does it say? Danger tracks out. Sorry I asked. Hi, kids. Say, did you know I didn't always used to walk on foot like this? I had a horse once. In fact, I was a Pony Express postman then. Like once, Wells Fargo asked me to deliver a million dollar gold shipment through the bandit infested badlands to Carson City. Well, sir, I hadn't picked up that shipment two minutes before suddenly up ahead. Uh huh. Here comes Stupid, and he's got the go. Toll road? Wonder how much? One million dollars, Stupid. Whoa, horse, I just had us an idea. This will sound funny, but back up. That's it. Now lift off. <laughs> this was almost too easy. Right. Next stop, Wells Fargo, office at Carson City. Fine. Just leave the girl behind. I wonder what's holding us up. An old friend. Now give me that gold or I'll blow your brains out. Assuming you have any. There goes your gun. There he is up there. Take the shortcut. You've got the gold, Postman, but Carson City is this way. Just try and get by. Okay, giddy up! Easy now, boy. We're almost across. You think you're so smart. Well, we're coming right back for that gold. Really? Upsy daisy. this girl goodbye. Don't be too sure. People have been wondering what happened to that gold delivery. And that's not my only delivery. I got another one here for the Hooskat. 
lovable truly, what you did as an exploit, they'll be telling and retelling all over the West. Why, everyone will want to hear it. Not everyone. Why don't they ever consider my feelings in these stupid stories? Remember the hole in the tracks? Well, here we go. Hey, hey, hey. How do you like that? Safe at last. We're finally stopping. This is really it. And no fooling. Uh-oh. And double. Uh-oh. Start pumping. Hey, gorilla. Want to see a funny story? Sorry you feel that way, but you're going to anyway. children friends today we have story of the thieves who fell out here we have bank notice it being robbed by three bank robbers bank robber chief used firecrackers to scare people inside and to confuse them while he made getaway Police chase bank robbers. Yo, oh, oh! We hold some other time. You dodge skyrocket. Oh, crime pay. Gold hot. We let cool off. I do that. You boys, Tuckard, take afternoon off. He invites us to bank robber chief I ever met. For I understanding. I'm not so sure. Something struck me fishy. Since there's no honor among thieves, chief, of course, tried to get gold all for himself. But he too fat to fit into hole. Not too fat. My shoulders too broad. Bank robber decide he need help from little guy with narrow shoulders. Suddenly, so I walk by. Hey, where you going? How I know till I get there. Ho, ho, ho. You're a smart lad. Like to earn penny? Penny? Honestly? Honestly, dishonestly. Penny is penny. Descend in hall. Get gold. Hall? Funny place for gold. I not hire you for opinions. Descend. Still funny place for... Hey, I really find gold. Hand over. Not till you pay penny. I see I dealing with shrewd businessman. Here. Thank you. <laughs> penny saved is penny earned. But the chief's two henchmen did decide something was fishy. And they came back to investigate. So, robbing fellow robbers? Our law can fuck sink those of conclusions. I rescuing gold from thief. Thief? Quiet thief. We're one for all and all for one. And I the one who get it all. Ha <laughs> ha! You violate code of underworld. Also upper world. Also my penny. All this yelling and shouting draw attention of police. Soon, everyone chasing bandit chief. I fast on feet, greed lends speed. But not enough. Dodge out of skyrocket. <laughs> Have knuckle sandwich and second knuckle sandwich, eh, Dickies? Hey! I want penny, not skyrocket. Thieves fall out. I know thief. Not thief. Must be hero. Thieves learn what we know all along. Crime not pay. And bank official so happy at hero who rescue all his gold that he say, Accept a generous reward. Penny. Wait. Shiny, no penny. Okay, some gone. That curtain fall. Moral of story, honorable children friends? 
When thieves fall out, honest men profit. Some profit, one penny. Okay, crime not pay, but crime fight and not pay either. A lady gorilla is chasing us. But we're faster on our feet than she is. Fortunately. <laughs> hey, Superman, help! Oh, 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 she likes you. Stop that, it's embarrassing. Hey, looky yonder. Jump and ship, eh? Yeah, it looks like you're jumping off. Not at all. I am simply throwing that switch. Hey, Linus, how do you know that switch was there? I am the king. I know exactly where everything is. <laughs> uh-huh. Well, King Yo, see you next week, you hear? Right, and you two fans, thanks for joining us. So long.